Hello there, fellow space captains. This is Connor, and welcome back to Dreadnought. The beautiful ship you're looking at right now is the Tier 4 Jupiter Arms Destroyer, the Vigo, which I have aptly named the Stormbringer. The only reason being is because it's equipped with storm missiles. These things are beastly and hilarious at the same time. Uh, so this is uh, a re-record. Live re-record, obviously. Uh, the previous game I recorded, it was awesome. But the in-game audio was way too high, which isn't good. So, we're going to start from here. We're going to have another game, and I was going to try Legendary to show you how much of a fight this thing can put up, even against Tier 5s, but that's not going to happen. There's nobody queuing up. If there is anybody, there's not enough for a full team. So, to Veteran we go, and I'm going to hit play. Get to your battle stations. Already there, bitch. And here we are. That was awful quick. You see, Veteran compared to Legendary is ridiculous. And I would prefer to play Legendary, even if I don't have a Tier 5. Tier 4s are more than enough to put up a fight against a Tier 5 if you know what you're doing. And, of course, you get a lot more XP, credits, and free XP, I believe, from just playing in Legendary anyway. Alas, nobody's playing it, so it's going to be a slow, slow grind. You know, I don't mind the grind from Tier 1 to 4. That's totally fine. And if maybe a Tier... 5 ship was like 150,000 XP instead of like what 220 or whatever it is. Oh, it's ridiculous. But Rings of Saturn, let's see if this will load. I've had really bad uh, experiences the past two days trying to connect to games where I get stuck in the loading screen like this. I can't open the task manager because this game will not minimize. So I have to log off. But we're here. Ah, oh, can I wanted to show you the Stormbringer. I guess I'm going to have to have a second game, huh? But uh, once I die, if I die, I'll load up the old Stormbringer. Oh god, I love that ship. But we're in the, um, oh, what do you call this ship again? How, how can I not remember this? I love this ship. But the only ship I can think of at the moment is Vigo. Okay, so somebody's sending missiles after me. So let's reduce our altitude there. Is there altitude in space? That's the thing, you're just in like a ma- Hello, bitch. Power to engines, afterburner, go. Not getting caught by a destroyer. Two destroyers, in fact. Talion's class, and we got another destroyer. Doesn't matter, though. I am out of there. Some sort of missile on our tail as well. Nuke launched by somebody. Right, take power off the engines for a moment. Oh, that guy is racking. Is that the Otis? It might be. Bontaminium. Okay, this guy's a softer target than the Jupiter Arms class. So what we're going to do... Come on, come on. Boost out of there. Okay, afterburner engaged. Power to engines engaged. We still have our kinetic weapon amplifier. Hello. Bye bye. Whoop! And I'm out of here. Take power off the engines, let it recharge. Got a kill. Say tier 3 can go up against a tier 4 anytime. But he was tier 3. So, yeah. Come on, get out of there. Who was firing at me? I don't know. Can I get some heals, bruh? Somebody. Need repair. Oh, God. Bomb catapults and all sorts. Just gonna have to linger here until I recharge. Replenish my health. So how's your day been, huh? Oh, well, here he is. He, he finally woke up. Or one of them woke up. Thank you, dude. All right, let's get back into the action. Cheers, bud. Got him. Finished him. Come on. Reload, damn it. Ah, damn it. Come on, torpedoes. Get him. Get him. Get him. Ah, you sons of bitches. Right, Stormbringer, where are you? There you are. Let's go, babe. Let's get stuck in. Take some noobs out. Or I might very well be the one that's going to get taken out. Could happen. It's happened quite a lot in the past. Oh, I love that bridge design. I've changed up the visual look of the ship. 
everyone seems to be using the Vigo. Everyone seems to be using the uh, Vigo customization. Come on, Storms, come on, baby, you can do it. Lance a nuke. Got him. Now, who is that? Oh, god damn it. Over on artillery cruiser. Being a fucking nuisance. Got you. I want to launch storms or something. Just keep one of them alive for the next 21 seconds, please. Weapon nullifier deployed. Okay, he's my target for the storm. He's out in the open. There's no chance they'll miss. The only problem is, does he have anti-missile lasers installed? So storms deployed. Watch this. Watch the storms. Watch them. Come on, storms, baby. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> I love this ship, and I love storms. <laughs> oh, that was enjoyable. Right, where's the rest of them? Another 19 seconds until complete and utter bliss. The only problem with the ship is I would like to have a bit more mobility. So I'm thinking of maybe doing something there. I, I don't know, I like having the incredible weapon amplifier installed on the ship. I mean, look how slow it is. Not quite dreadnought slow, but not far off. Right, a couple of destroyers on a dreadnought below. Tier 4, he looks like. Is he a tier 4? Yeah, he's tier 4. We'll go for this artillery cruiser. So I shouldn't even need to fire at him. The storms, if they reach him, should be able to completely knock him out of the game. See, there we go. <laughs> I love these things. God damn it. Wasn't fast enough. See what I mean? Deploying your storms and getting out of there, that's the best part. And, uh, well, we've got a tier 2 dreadnought asking why he hasn't got any healers. <laughs> Wouldn't make a difference, dude. It would not make a difference. And here we are. GG. If I can get there, GG well played. Didn't even come in the top five. Don't give a damn. I had my fun. Too many morons. It's T double O by the way. Uh doesn't look good for you, dude. Anyway, let's have another game, huh? Ready oh, so we've got a team death match on Capabius. And I'm in the Isle Stormbringer. Right from the start this time. No jumping in without being able to select your ship. No, no, no. What there looks pretty damn cool. Is that the Morning Star? It's not, but it looks very similar. I really like the bridge. Right, let's do this. Oh, that that was unfortunate for this guy. What is going on here? What the f fudging hell just happened there? Why did he spawn right beside us? Did one of our guys spawn right beside them as well? Doesn't look like it happened. Thanks for the help. Missile locked, ready to fire. Storm missiles locked on the enemy. Come on, storms. Ah, damn it. If you want to pull me in, dude? That's that's fair enough. Enemy missiles incoming, Captain. You can pull me any day, babe. Fusion reactor is overheating. Put the energy system offline. Systems drain, Captain. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. wrecked there by Ram. Was it him in the ramming ship? It was Saber Cat. Oh, Saber Cat. Oh dear. I have a feeling you're going to go for me every time, aren't you? Don't do it. It's not cool. I don't want to unleash the storm on you. Alright, okay, let's do this tactically. We've got. There he is, I can see him just by the. Speed on the minimap of the ship of the destroyer insignia or symbol. Weapon breaker missile locked on. Storm missiles have a lock. 
Yeah, but they're not going after a damn Corvette, not in this terrain. So, picking up enemy contact over there. Another Corvette, probably going to try and flank. More than likely, they are Corvettes after all. Full power to maneuvering thrusters. Weapon breaker locked on target. Okay, we've got a couple of ships here. Storm missiles locked on enemy ship. Enemy warheads locked on our position. Go storms. Right, what have we got here? Oh, a saber cat just got its teeth pulled out. No fangs anymore. Uh, not wasting the time on that guy. Took the power off the engines. Oh, look how slow this thing is. Does it need to be this slow? I don't. I, don't. I mean, it goes faster up and down than it does any other direction. Right, let's try and get oh artillery cruiser, perfect. Let's go. Is good. Weapon breaker primed. Weapon now, Weapon activated, come on, come on, storms, come on, come on, baby. Yes, yes, come on. Any help, please? Anyone? Instead of sitting up there just firing across the chips that are being healed, maybe, possibly. Ah, losing my mind, losing my mind. Well, I suppose sitting up there doing bugger all is working for them. I mean, look at this guy. Where is he? Help that guy out. Nullify his damage a little bit. Okay, so Sabercat switched to a Dreadnought. The storm has come, little one. Can't to embrace its devastating power. Boo, baby, boom. Get attacked, healers, you idiots. Good boys, good boys, there we go. Targeting him. Go, go, go. <laughs> that quarterback just ran a dreadnought, and the dreadnought just flew away. Realistic. Totally realistic. Physics in this game are bonkers. Shield activated. Amplifying weapon systems. Weapon boost pulse, come on, everyone. Increase damage. Fire on my target. All ships, enemy contact. At this location. Storms. This time you die. Amplifying weapons eye. Waiting for launcher to reload, Captain. Oh, armor amplifier, you wasted my god dumb. Storms. Heresy. Heresy of the 10th degree, whatever that means. Not doing great here. But I'd rather have fun than get kills. That's, that's not true at all. I want to get kills. It's just that we're not really coordinated as, as a team. Our Corvettes are bumping into Dreadnoughts and hunting down other Corvettes instead of actually trying to get their healers, which is something I like to do quite a bit whenever I'm... Come on, boys, come on. Oh, God damn it. They're not going to reach him. They would have killed him instantly as well. Attack is the healers! Please! Anybody? Anybody want to attack healers? Pretty please, I, I beg of thee. Negative. Launcher still reloading. This is going super well, huh? I'm starting to get flashbacks of nightmares they've had of fractured space and the team coordination in that game that's rarely there. Storm missiles have a lock. Shield activated. Oh. Got some storms away at least. But nada. Tier 2! Wise up, man! Fix your fleet. Right, bloody Egypt. Let's go. Let's go, team. We can take this back, can't we? I don't have any hope in doing that, actually. <laughs> 
situation's grave, Captain. I know I can see the bloody score at the bottom. Well, oh my god, look at their healers. That is bullshit. Gotcha, bitch. You're next, potato ship. Come on. Oh my god, come on, hurry up. Seriously. Well played, potato ship, well played. I mean, our, our, and our team are actually always just flying in the battle. That's how quickly we're having to respawn, how often. And the match is almost over, thank god. By the way, your team, Sabercat, I love you, but your team are all bullshit. I mean, look at all these fucking healers, that is just... Limit the game, please, Jaeger. Limit the game to two healers per game, please, per match. I would say a GG, but it wasn't a GG. It was a, well, well played in the enemies. Well, not really, because they were all using healers. Dickheads. Scumbags. I'll just say GG just because I'm being nice. But that ain't cool. And there's far too much of it, and it's been happening for ages, and, uh, well, the devs at Dreadnought, I believe there's two, there's one in Texas and one in Germany somewhere, they've yet to address it. They're more, well, I think they're more interested in putting out skins, cosmetics, uh, hero ships to make money, which is fine, I mean, it's a free-to-play game. They'll have to make money somehow, but still, the game is, oh, it's just those healers, man, they get me so riled up. Oh god, I should have done something about this at this point. I mean it's been going on for ages. The amount of complaints on the forums as well. Whatever. Whatever. It's over. I can go to bed and cry now. So uh yeah, end of the video. Thank you very much for watching all. If you want to support me on the channel, you can do so by following the Patreon or the donation link in the description below. I would very much appreciate it. Very much so. And uh thanks for watching. Enjoy whatever it is you're playing, whether it be in space or otherwise. And there, of course, we'll see you next time. Oh, and sorry, just to mention, I'd like to thank all my current patrons at the moment for sticking with me uh, through a difficult time recently on YouTube because of, well, the apocalypse. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye. Good day, loyal citizens of the Empire. Today, the Emperor has employed a system that will allow you to support the latest Imperial endeavors. Click the link below to support a safer and brighter future for every citizen of the Empire.